Uh, hello, YouTube. Back once again with my Sleepy Hollow reviews. Uh, sorry, I didn't, I didn't review last week's episode, uh, Blood and Fear. I was busy, but uh, let me just say clearly what I thought set that episode. Uh, just another decent episode. Um, I liked how the how this, it was tied into um, tied into uh, the web, the Miss Evil monster was tied into Jack the Ripper. I thought it was pretty funny, but um, the fact that Ichabod confronted him when he was a kid, I thought that was really pretty, pretty darkly hilarious. But uh, no, but here we are. So, and besides that, just another completely fine episode. Uh, but here we are with episode four, The Sisters Mills. I say this is the first great episode of the season. I think the last three episodes were good. This was great. This episode, um, plot of this episode is uh, they're kind of they're trying to fight. They're trying to fight a monster called the Tooth Fairy, and um. And, uh, yeah, who's been taking kids' souls, and, uh, that's part of the episode, uh, yeah, and all I can say is, uh, one, the monster was really creepy this episode, it kind of looked like the Babadook, he's supposed to be, like, start, like, jumping on the ceiling, like, crawling around, it was kind of, like, felt like, like, frame by frame, like, cutting, like, I thought that looked very much like the Babadook, and, um, so there was that, uh, I love the historical aspect when you learn that Paul Revere, like, even though he was a dentist, like, he, he started the whole putting, co putting silver coins under your kid's bed when they lose a tooth, it's because, it was because the silver ro repels the monster, I thought that was pretty funny, um, so there's that. Um, God, Tom Myson, he was just enjoying this episode, really hamming it up this week. Uh, I love when he was just talking to Abby about, like, historical accuracies. I thought that was really funny. That, um, the scene where he's trying to bond with the little kid doing the corner behind the ear trick, I thought that was really funny. And, um, that and the scene when she, he teaches a young, uh, young group of kids about, uh, hi the history. That was hilarious. I love how, um, Heavy sister Jenny was just like, even just kind of like took it out. <laughs> I felt like how I would be in that situation. Just took out her phone, just be like, oh, I need a recording of this. I thought that was hilarious. And uh, that and that the ending of the episode when, um, we learn Ichabod's a bit lonely when, uh, when he, when he's under, I forget what dentists use to knock people out, whatever it's called. I, uh, I don't know. Um, Whatever they use, when you see, when you saw you had a, he was having a dream about making out with Betsy Ross, how, uh, God, when is she gonna show up this season already, saying old, um, but he's, and then he went, and then, like, when, like, he comes through, you just see him like this, and we're like, oh, yes, man, and then, like, I was like, you okay, and then he's like, yes, yes, I'm okay, and then, um, Ichabod's girlfriend, I forget what her name is, uh, whatever her name is, the one who's helping her, him get American citizenship, like, sends him a picture, sends him a picture of, like, an animation of him, like, riding an eagle, and he's just, and then Tom Weissen was like, I'm, I'm adorable, and just starts bursting into tears, I thought that was just so funny, Tom Weissen was just a joy in this episode, um, yeah, is there really anything else to say in this episode? Just a lot of good lines, uh, not much in the... Emotional continuity, nothing very heartfelt between Abby or Ichabod this week. Um, anything else to really say? I feel that, um, no, not really. I'll say this, though. Uh, the actress who plays Pandora, uh, I know I was very hesitant about during her first two episodes. I think she's becoming quite the joy now. Uh, she, her character is just getting so bad. She's le and she does seem like to be having so much more fun. Like, uh, when she just starts making sinister smiles and starts taunting people. Like, she's becoming a lot of fun. I don't know what her plan is. It seems to be making a giant tree come to life, but whatever. Uh... So there's so there's that. She, Pandora's becoming a very fun villain. I'll give I give the actress a lot of credit, and yeah, that's the episode. Just another good uh, for first great one of the season, I would say, because the comedy was so strong this episode. So uh, YouTube, as always, please subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Okay, bye.